Hello fellow developers, welcome back to our channel. Today we are diving into the world of styling Angular applications using the ever popular utility first CSS framework Tailwind CSS. By the end of this video, you will know exactly how to set up and use Tailwind CSS in your Angular projects. If you don't already have an Angular project, let's create one quickly. So first of all, open your terminal and right now you can see I am using Angular CLI version 16.1.8. So I will just use the command ng new Tailwind CSS press enter if you want to add routing then you can just type y i would say no and i would use scss after that you have to wait for some time and once it is installed and created you have to go to your newly created project directory by using the cd command and then you will have to open it in the vs code so you can use any of your favorite editor but in this video we will be using the vs code by the way if you don't have the CLI installed or if you don't have node.js or npm installed already you can simply go to my youtube channel and you can search for the videos you will find all of the videos so for example so for example if i search install angular you can see that i have several videos about installing angular for example you can install uh, the angular CLI or you can install on the linux or if you want to learn how to install the node you can learn that as well so i have several videos that you can follow and make it possible for you so after you have it installed you can continue from here all right the project has been installed and created successfully now we will go to that go to that folder by using tailwind css and open it in your favorite editor once it is opened we will run this project in the browser for that open the terminal in that root directory of your project and run the command ng serve minus o that will open the project in the browser so the angular project is running successfully now open the tailwind css documentation click on the docs and click on the framework guides here you can see it has created the guide for multiple frameworks uh, so you can try others as well if you are using them in this video we will be installing for angular so just click on angular and follow these steps we already have created the project now we need to install the tailwind css post css and auto prefixer so just copy this command and open a new terminal in the root directory of your project and paste that command and copy this command as well so after this installation is done you need to initialize your tailwind css and your project so let's do that okay with that you will notice that a new file tailwind config dot tailwind dot config dot js file is generated now we need to copy this code and replace it with this one after that we need to copy this code and uh, style dot scss and paste here now uh, after that is done we need to you can just stop the server and start it, start it again to make sure that everything is still applied so just to test it i will open the source app app component delete everything and now create a div h1 tag or whatever you want here i will add hello world and let's add text 3xl and you can see that the text has been increased i can increase the size further like 9xl as well so also i can try multiple other classes like flex justify center item center and width full h full and let me try screen okay you can see that we can very easily now style our components by using the tailwind css that's it tailwind css beautifully integrated into your angular you can harness the power of this utility first framework in your angular components if you found this tutorial helpful please give us a thumbs up share and subscribe for more development tutorials drop any questions or comments below and we will do our best to respond happy coding and goodbye